to the Sunday Telegraph now and Northumbria police are being anti-immigrant. But don't worry, it's against white people, so it's OK. Cresta, you've got this one. I've got this one. Vikings could be connected to the far right. <laughs> According to a police-backed <laughs> audit of monuments linked to oppressive oh. behaviour. So Northumbria police took part in a re review of statues and landmarks to establish which sites might be associated with slavery and other forms of oppression. Yeah. So I know how delighted you are about the police being funded to, to look into these types <laughs> well, of issues, yeah. Leo, rather Thank than Thank God they've, they've eliminated crime in Northumbria. <laughs> and they've got time to like do an audit of statues to find out what Viking ones are racist. But to be fair, even the police in the Star Report came out and said, we think this is probably a waste of, of our resources. Only oh, some really? former <laughs> police, some former police did, not, not the current ones. Oh, this, is, this is a statue, uh, I think Viking statue. I think it's taken out because it's horrible. I mean, I think you know what that is. So it's it's that, two Vikings. That looks like two Vikings. And if you don't know the, the, history, the, of, um, the history of Vikings, they, they came over and they, uh, they did a lot of uh, you know, pillaging and rape, a lot of Me Too stuff, but we didn't have Twitter, so we couldn't stop yeah. it, couldn't get a hashtag going. And uh, they... They made the Irish more attractive, though, they in the long run. Slaves. Yeah, yeah, so there's, there's now a lot of... Although they seem to have skipped Dumfries. But they, <laughs> um, yeah, so they, they, they did all that. Um, and now, you know, now they're saying there's a link between the far right and Vikings and this Viking heritage, which seems very unfair. It seems to be linking a very small... Uh, proportion of the population to, to this Viking heritage, which a lot of people in the UK would have. Well, this article also right. said that um, apparently Hitler adopted some, some uh, Aryan warriors stuff from the Vikings, from, from, the, from the, the, the Nordic rune Sowilo. The SS used the Nordic rune Sowilo, uh, which is the appearance of a lightning bolt. Yeah, so but Hitler also used like a lot zip of other stuff. zippers on his trousers. He so what did. we don't have zippers on our trousers now. We walk around with our genitals falling out. I mean, well, this is not. He used a Middle Eastern symbol too that was uh, thousands of years old that he How's reversed. That going to keep trousers fastened. Yeah, it's 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 a farce. What annoys me is they're looking at blue plaques as well mentioned here. I, I always think if it's problematic, put a plaque on it. Meaning, tell everybody what it is and what it did. Mm, right. Put a plaque on it. Don't go after the blue plaques. Yeah, I mean, yeah. that's just going after reality, isn't it? Yeah, or at least at least. Please give me reparations. Yeah. It's being, being a Scot who was probably, my great, 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 great grandma was probably pillaged by, by some of these Vikings. Yeah. Give me some reparations. They can afford it, these Norwegians. 